Hey guys, I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. Whether you're watching this in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the evening, I'm glad you're here. First thing I want to do is just give a big thank you to all the channel members. Thank you guys, I appreciate you. And I want to thank anybody who's taken the time to come in to check out my knife, my EDC content. I appreciate you all. Um, if you're so inclined and you hadn't had a chance yet, if you'd hit that subscribe button and the bell notification icon, it would really help me out. Today is just a kind of a short unboxing, won't take long at all. And this is a package that's come in from Oak City Leather Supply that I ordered, mm, I say it's about, it seems to take about two and a half weeks, maybe two and a half weeks ago. Um, let's see what we have here. Breaking out our Amazon. Hadn't cut my finger off with it yet, knife. Razor knife. This is the second order I placed with them. First thing I ordered from them was this sheath for my T. Denny Apprentice and MagnaCut. Then I ordered this guy for this TJ Apprentice. And this is a version 3, which is a different sheath altogether. Um, I got the Ulti Clip instead of the, uh, the Deep Concealment Carry, because I wanted to try something a little different. It's still mounted deep down in there. What's kind of funny is I'm not 100% sure if I got this for this knife. I think I did. So version 3, hmm, that is interesting. What else would I have gotten it for? I think it was this one because I got the orange thread to match. So it was for this knife. This is just, like I said, his Gen 3 because this now comes with G10 handles. So that's going to be it right about there. I did the blue leather. I forget exactly what they call that. Let's see where I want that to be. Oh, it's coming about right there. So yeah, we've got this little pocket dropper here for our T. Denny Apprentice. And then we've got our other T. Denny Apprentice here, our Deepy. This is the Gen 2 which is kind of a more full concealment. So yeah, guys, checking it out. I've got a couple of these for my uh, chickadees that they came in. So that's kind of how I heard about Oak City Leather was picking up a chickadee. I think it was from Lefty, my first. No, it was from uh, Honey Bear. Honey Bear had an Oak City Leather sheath in the... Uh, the um, chickadee he sold me, and then um, Lefty had a left-handed slip, which didn't matter to me because I carried it in my back pocket. Um, I love these sheaths. This one's a little deep, but it still carries good. When I say deep, the handle's not as exposed. Whereas this one in my back pocket... It's going to be a lot easier to draw once it forms up. But they're really well made. Let me uh, reach into my pocket. I don't know if you guys can see down in there. But there's no metal exposed on the inside of that sheath, of course. It's just really done well.
and I'm a fan. And they're right, um, if I'm not mistaken, they're in North Carolina. Um, he's got these on the website just to kind of pre-order. And then, like I say, it takes a couple of weeks, a few weeks, maybe three weeks at the most. But that is my second Oak City leather sheath. And then I've got a couple of Be Up tags that Brother Joe Isabella sent in. And I can't be more stoked with these guys. Um, I've also got a little chain that's hooked up with me with the, for a couple of mushrooms. This little guy, the green slime guy, I love that. Because on the back, I don't know if you can read it. But so these guys will always, uh, this is the closest I got to a Chewy. So I'm going to cherish these guys. And they will show up in, uh, in the videos from now on, moving forward. So there, there you have it. So the second Oak City Leather Sheath, both for my T-Denny Apprentice, although this sheath would probably work fine for a knife like a Hurricane, if you wanted to carry that short or let's see what else we've got small around us here. Our Baltic Blades Angus. So yeah, little pocket dropper, which is how I typically carry well a lot, some a lot of small fixed blades I will carry on my um, appendix right to the right of my belt buckle. Um, but those are for the much shorter blades. These are a little bit longer blades I like to carry in a pocket. So, Oak City Leather Supply. I can highly uh, recommend them. I wonder why this one doesn't have a stamp on it. Maybe he just didn't want to... Hmm. I like the blue. It's a different color. I mean, there's so many choices. They're probably, I don't know, um, I'm going to guess eight color choices for the leather and then you've got several color choices probably 20 for the thread um, you can do a primary thread and a secondary thread because he does do several different um, different types of slips slash sheaths some of them have multiple layers uh, check it out I'll leave a link I have no affiliation with Oak City Leather except I like their stuff but I will leave a link in um, the description to their Instagram and to their website. But guys, I appreciate you all. All I ask is please, please, please look out for that guy or gal to your left. Look out for the guy or gal to your right. Please look out for each other. Go forward with love in your heart. And always choose debate, not hate. I love you all. Peace.